Hi, welcome to the Bean Factory. We're super excited to show you the 2019 Bean, and right now we're looking at the meter bean option, and uh, it's a nice little teardrop trailer with a lot of features that I think you're gonna enjoy. We're gonna start by looking at the front of the trailer, and you can see that we have a modular powder-coated rack system. And this rack system will allow you to do a lot of different things. It'll allow you to have your own containers that you can put into it. It'll also, you to have, also allow you to have something like these uh, lockers. These lockers are custom lockers that allow you to store your gear. Whether you're a climber or a mountain biker, you come back from your adventure and have a great spot to store your gear. You'll also see a full-size spare You'll see a battery box, a battery box that uh, houses a great 100 amp uh, AGM battery with a solar port and a brake controller. As we go around to the front, we can see uh, that we have a breakaway tongue that allows you to pull this pin and store a bean and, and swing the tongue away so that you can store it conveniently in your garage. So now we're going to work our way around to the side of bean. And one of the things we want you to notice is the detailing, the quality of the hardware that we use on anything and the fit and finish and the refinement of the design that you see on the bean trailer. One of the most common questions we get about Bean is what makes Bean different than other trailers? So in addition to the refinement and quality materials, the biggest difference between Bean and other trailers is this one piece fiberglass design. We've eliminated the seam or, seam or joint line between the roof panel and the side panel. And that means that water can never get into this joint. For all intents and purposes, this is just a cosmetic line and not an actual seam. And it's probably easier to see on this uh, section of the roof and sidewall. So this one piece roof and sidewall is probably easier to demonstrate on this section. You can see that the sidewall transitions to the roof without any seam line. In addition, Bean uses a composite material for its sidewall instead of plywood. So this results in much straighter walls and a better insulated trailer. This beautifully sculpted fender is powder coated for durability. One of the things that's super cool about this fender is that you can actually stand on it so that you can get to your rack, your rack system and all of your accessories. As we continue along the back, you can see that you have shore power, you have your water inlet, you have your gray water outlet, and you have these robust and sturdy um, jacks that will literally lift the trailer off the ground. And we wanna talk a little bit about the doors and the options. You can see that we have very robust hardware that is used to actually pull the door open. No flimsy little latches on beam that you have to worry about breaking. Um, many of our beans incorporate a screen door so that on those warm summer nights, you can actually open up both sides and get a nice cross breeze going through your trailer. The refinement of Bean is self-evident in the galley and uh, you can see it in the sculpted rear hatch with uh, details like embossed Bean logos with a sculpted platform for a very convenient paper towel dispenser. We have uh, sliding doors in Bean that have uh, extremely durable plastic laminates in a variety of different colors and finishes or you can opt for real wood veneers with 
grain matching patterns. Opening the sliding door, you can see beans great storage capacity with adjustable shelves and an IKEA bin system that and these bins come in a variety of different sizes to suit your need. Um, we have a optional stainless steel counter that has a solid surface veneer uh, backsplash for ease of cleaning and durability. We have an incorporated sink with a adjustable faucet and a pump. Underneath the sink we have a cabinet door that has a large water tank with a self-draining feature. This rack out tray is powder coated and actually locks out and uh, you can use whatever uh, ice box you prefer or we can also provide you with a Norco freezer refrigerator as an option. When we developed the galley we didn't want to take up a bunch of extra space for uh, the stove on the counter so we developed this rack out stove system that has an expedition grade stove that opens up and attaches to this large propane tank on the side. We also use the propane tank as uh, a platform for this side table that also serves as a cutting board. So when you're cooking your food, uh, you can uh, place it on the side table and serve from here. The side table removes and serves a double function in being by being placed underneath the counter and used as a cutting board again uh, freeing up counter space. One of the features that we got a lot of questions about is the accent lighting We've built in this accent lighting so that when you're out enjoying nature, uh, you're not turning on an extremely powerful light and broadcasting that light all over uh, the campground or your camp spot. So this light is very convenient, gives you enough light to work under and allows you to change it to a color that would not attract bugs. So every bean is differentiated by its own icon. Right now we're looking at the meaner bean. And the biggest difference between the meaner bean and other beans is this amazing 3,500 pound Timberin independent suspension. This suspension gives bean incredible off-road capabilities. You can see that there is no axle connecting both of the suspension members and that gives you great ground clearance. As we're, we look under the trailer we can see that our floor is all fiberglass construction for durability. You'll never have to worry about it rotting and uh, it's also fully insulated. This beam is currently in what we call travel mode, meaning that the mattress is folded up and in a bag to keep it clean. This gives you perfect place to store your camp chairs, your, um, your camp box, your grill, whatever it is that you like to use when you uh, camp. One of the things we're very proud of is the interior of Bean. Uh, we really tried to duplicate uh, the comfort uh, that you feel in some of the new modern hotels where 
you immediately feel like you're welcome and at home. You know, we've accomplished this with uh, uh, quality materials. For example, this uh, real wood veneer that's available on Bean. We've also accomplished it with soft touch materials. These are not hard surfaces like this vinyl roof and these beautiful recessed lights that create a very inviting cabin. You'll also notice that we have a Max Air fan that is available with a remote control so that you don't even have to get move away from the comfort of the back cushions to operate it. We designed Bean to be very ergonomic from a sitting or lying position. Uh, the sleeping room inside of Bean is actually the same size as a queen size mattress. This is a very comfortable mattress with uh, memory foam and this will actually fold. This mattress will actually fold. to access the floor storage, which is available on all beans. You'll also notice that there are tie downs to secure your load. And the option of some very comfortable cushions so that you can relax after a hard day of adventure. Uh, nice, thoughtful features like uh, organizers and cup holders so one of the things that's very important uh, for a teardrop trailer is to have well thought out and uh, usable storage and so we have maximized the amount of storage that you have in being uh, again you have these cabinet doors with matching wood veneers that actually pass through to the galley and again the trofast bins that you can configure exactly how you need them in addition to those cabinets you have these drawers that have a uh, platform so that you can put your laptop or your ipad and a great uh, drawer storage and then you have a large drawer in the middle that allow you to organize all your clothes and anything else that you're trying to take while traveling with Bean. On, on one of the drawers you'll see that we've provided a vanity mirror uh, that should help uh, I don't know. That's going to help you. Not look, that will help you not look ugly. Help you look good on the trail. <laughs> yeah, will help you be cute on the trail. Uh, this large area is conveniently illuminated with accent lighting. We have operable blinds and operable windows so that you can see the outside world. And safety features like a, safety features like a carbon monoxide detector and a fire detector along with a fire extinguisher. On the front of Bean, on the front of Bean, uh, the storage continues with this cubby that is right above your head. And what's really nice about this cubby is that it has task lighting that's convenient and also has a USB port so that you can charge your telephone. You'll notice one of the options that we have on Bean is this Proplex forced air heater. It works from the propane tank in the front locker and is actually thermostat controlled. So you can determine exactly what temperature you want the Bean to be. Bean comes with an optional roof rack and our roof rack 
basically ends here and provides you with a platform where you can use any roof rack system and accessories that you're comfortable with, whether it's Thule or Yakima. We're showing, showing Rhino rack right now, but it could be any roof rack system that you're comfortable with. Uh, some of the options uh, that you can use the roof rack for are things like a canopy that you can deploy and also a rooftop tent and uh, coming around here a road shower so those are just some of the many options that you can choose to store on top of Bean. one of the options that Bean gets a lot of attention for is the ability to uh, mount bikes on the front of Bean and that can be mounted and, and those can be mountain bikes or road bikes uh, and you can mount as many as four bikes to the front of Bean utilizing a variety of different rack systems. This one happens to be the Alta rack system but it can be other vertically mounted bike racks. On the back of Bean, you'll notice a hitch receiver on a, on a meaner Bean like this one that has an independent suspension, you are able to actually connect a bike rack back here without destroying your bikes. And this also allows you to put a step into that hitch receiver that will allow you to access the roof of Bean so that you can uh, deploy or take down your rooftop tent. Bean is an extremely easy light trailer to tow with um, its gross weight being in the neighborhood of 1,800 to 2,000 pounds for the mean and meaner bean variations. Prices start in the 16s for mean and in the 17s for meaner bean. That's a wrap on our 2019 Mean Bean and Meaner Bean review. For more information, you can go to beantrailer.com. You can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, push the button to subscribe. Thanks.